hello uh, my name is uh, Vishal Rain uh, in this video I would like to uh, discuss about setting up a project and uh, saving your uh, scene files uh, so here uh, we have uh, a simple scene there's nothing about the scene here so if you go to the uh, file menu there we have an option called project window I just click that option and there we have uh, this window uh, uh, firstly I would like to talk about uh, what is a project uh, project uh, is a collection of folders with specific file types see your Maya file is associated with so many uh, resources uh, which can be a texture which can be a, a cache file or audio file so the files which are not Maya files but still they are part of your Maya file so it is very important to carry your files with uh, so uh, we have to organize them into pro a proper folder directory so setting a project uh, is all about doing that so right now when I have opened this project window we have uh, this option called current project current project is a project uh, to which right now I am associated with uh, right now I'm associated with a project uh, which is jar in personal 3d works and uh, Dwayne rock is the name of the project uh, alternately if I want to create a new project I could just click this button new and then I can generally uh, give a name uh, to the project I just give uh, first project uh, and uh, where I want to put my project I can just and then say accept uh, so the first project if you see uh, these are the folders uh, first project and uh, there is a folder called assets auto save cache clips data images movies render data scene assembly scenes scripts sound source images uh, time editor uh, this every folder will keep a different type of file uh, so for example if I have to save my file I just click the save button here we are in the status line or I can go to file and then just choose the save scene or I can press ctrl s on the keyboard and then uh, I get the file and this particular file should go into my uh, scenes folder defaultly that uh, will happen when I put the save scene uh, my browser will directly open my scenes folder there but anyhow you can save your file Maya file into the scenes folder any image if you are bringing outside uh, fr from outside for example your textures uh, these images are basically the uh, images uh, which come from outside so they are basically uh, source images uh, so all my textures will be saved in source images folder or any image planes uh, which we use for modeling also will be there in the source images folder for example if I if I render anything here uh, the image uh, will be saved into images folder okay so uh, if you render a play blast video it goes into movies folder if you have a audio file which you use for lip sync animation that image that audio file should be saved in sounds so I'll be just saving the file here uh, and we have two different formats in Maya to save uh, one is uh, Maya ASCII and uh, another one is uh, Maya binary uh, ASCII is basically a short form of American standard code for information interchange okay this is uh, ASCII I stands for I often call it as ASCII 
uh, but uh, it is MA format okay another uh, format is uh, Maya binary okay so we have uh, Maya ASCI Maya American Standard Code for Information Interchange Maya binary so these are uh, two different ways how your Maya file will be saved uh, what happens if I save into ASAI format or MA format so um, I'll just name it as test uh, MA or just I'll just name it as test 01 and save it and I'll save another file uh, I'll go for save scene as option and then we have uh, uh, another file in which I'm going to save it is Maya binary format and then uh, I'll open my scenes folder and if you see here I've got uh, MA format uh, which is uh, uh, 55 KB and MB format 53 KB there's only 2 KB difference but uh, if it is a very big scene uh, the difference could be much uh, higher um, MB is a very compact version uh, in the file format saving and uh, ASCII uh, is a little bit more elaborated uh, if I just open this file with uh, wordpad instead of Maya you see uh, that the text here is a uh, human readable text and uh, this text can be edited even if there is no Maya you know some programming then you can edit uh, the content of this uh, particular uh, file this is a human readable file uh, whereas uh, if I open the test 0 to MB file uh, with uh, the word pad again uh, this is not a human readable file whereas you can't edit them uh, the more stable version uh, for me is MA format uh, because uh, one thing is it is stable and uh, another thing is uh, you can edit if uh, if the file is corrupted by any chance so uh, highly recommended format is a uh, uh, MA format uh, for saving the file and uh, if you save your file while saving uh, the file here um, I'll just uh, take a new scene and then uh, go to file and open the options here uh, we have uh, the incremental save option and then if we put a limit for the incremental save and then when we save the file it will save as let's say if I name it as ball it will name it as ball but next time when I press ctrl s it will save as ball number one or, and then if I press again ctrl s it will save it as ball number two so it doesn't actually save on the same file but uh, ma it makes a new uh, copy of it a sort of backup file and you save your file that way so that is incremental save we have compressed save where your file format will be I mean where your file is compressed to um, a particular format but uh, however it will save in your MA file only um, preserve the name during compression it is again about uh, then the file name uh, so it will keep the file name as it is so uh, that's for that and we have a save uh, thumbnail uh, for or save play, play blast for your image what that actually does is if I put the capture button uh, you got this uh, nice uh, frame and I need to just frame in uh, the subject closely and then you want to do a video or you want to do a image you can choose between them thumbnail gives me an image play blast gives me a small video uh, so I'm just choosing the thumbnail and then I say capture so there's a file say and I need to save this okay and now if I save the scene file uh, into um, I'm just naming this as TM and then choose the format to uh, Maya ASCII format um, if I just open the uh, directory um, 
uh, you see the the icon is no change uh, comparing to what it was there earlier and 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 one more thing if any time if the uh, maya file is not identifying right click choose the properties and then here you change uh, to the file format and then your fi your file will be identified accordingly okay and uh, now uh, the thumbnail should be shown here but it's not here exactly uh, it should be showing the thumbnail in uh, the window called uh, content browser I'll open that and then I need to choose my file and then save scenes and you see you see the file uh, is basically having the thumbnail which I have captured if I hover the cursor it may play the quick video of what exactly this thumbnail has in it will be seen that's why we do the play blast also so this is uh, about uh, the saving scene and setting up the project